this is our competition. See those little kids right there? Right there? They're going down. I'd actually really appreciate it if we can get another one of these made. Freeze. <laughs> what? Good morning. Um, it is now Monday. No, it's not. It's Tuesday. It's Thursday. It's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I don't even know what today is. But welcome to yet another vlog. I apologize for not uploading it yesterday, but you know it, it is going to happen. Whoever dropped my hat and didn't pick it up, that's a that's a violation. Okay, that's a villain's hat. God damn it. Um, anyway, so. Uh, I, I did start vlogging yesterday, but the day got away from me because I started playing Blackout. And I, and I realized that every single time that I play Blackout, no matter how hard I try to just, you know, be, be a good human being and, and, and literally just take my time in, in doing stuff, I can't get away from Blackout. And, and, and bottom line, that's what it is. Today, we're going to be shooting a video for, hold on one second, Game Fuel. As you guys can see here, you guys remember the drill? You guys remember the drill? It goes a little bit, something like, Five, four, three, two. Ooh. And then you squeeze, you, you scoot it back. Oh, and then it's off to the races, baby guy. Woo! Anyway, so we're shooting uh, a demo. My team is Scumpy, Scumpy, Big Timer, and Mental. I'm on my way to pick up Scumpy. Immediately after that, um, Big Timer's gonna come back down here to the studio, and we're gonna shoot the podcast. Uh, but today I'm gonna be wearing my Halo op Optic Gaming World Championship ring, mate. Okay, that's what I mean. Just to let, the, to let everybody, everybody there know that a champion is coming to compete against. Okay, so in honor of the Halo team, I shall represent as best as I can as a true champion. You know what I'm saying? Um, they're going to call me Royal 3 by the time we're done with this gosh darn tournament. Or they're going to call me Snakebite Hex or Lethal Hex. I can't be Frosty Hex because... I'm not that cool. I'm not cool enough to be frosty. All right, let's get going. Let me see my keys. Keys, let's get it. Vlogging as a profession, and I'm not saying that that's my only profession, but it is definitely a big part of what it is that I do on a daily basis, is it's, it's at times very, very therapeutic. It is very ther therapeutic in the sense that, you know, not, not often does one get to, to talk into an object, right? And I know this obviously translates to hundreds of thousands of people. Um, pardon me. It translates, but at, at the end of the day, I know, and I know that you guys see this differently because you're, you guys are looking on your screen. Um, but for me, it's I'm, I'm in a car and I'm talking into an object, and it's therapeutic in the sense that, I, although I am talking to a lot of you, I'm also talking to myself and some of the thoughts that I have, um, and. I don't know. It's a, it's it's a, it's a, it's a good thing to to speak out loud and not let your thoughts be thoughts. You know what I'm saying? You probably don't, but if for those of you who do, thank you. Let's go pick up Seth, who's still sleeping probably. Henry, hello, big boy. You haven't been in the vlog in all all year, brother. What's up, Benjamin? What's up, Pancho Pablo? Get it. Get it. Fight. Fight. No, I'm kidding. Don't fight, boys. Be nice. Give me that fucking duck. Come here. What the people? What's the people? Who is he? Who the biggest boy of them all? Is his name Harry? So Scumpy has been living with me for the past three months, and that's awesome. That's my little brother, whatever. But my mi casa is la casa de él, which of course in Latin means something else. Anyway, so. Um, his house is done. His house is ready to be moved in. It's just that uh, utilities and a whole bunch of other stuff still needs to be handled. He's uh, he's up and ready to go. Well, he's up, not ready to go. So we gotta wait half an hour for him to to be ready. I'm gonna go catch up on a quick shot. I have like a, a, about 45 minutes until he gets up and is ready to go. So I'm gonna go in the theater room, watch a little show, catch up on some stuff, and and then. Be good to go. Change of plans since um, since Seth is not ready, I'm gonna go pick up Hitch, and then I'm gonna go back to my house, pick up Seth, and then we're gonna head to the obstacle course. I think it's an obstacle course. It can't be paintball two back-to-back -back weeks. Either way, I'm, I'm, we're heading there now. 
get hitch. We've made it to the destination. I'll obviously not be able to show you what it is that we're doing, but it's pretty much uh, what we started out with, with the very, very, yeah. very, what's up? It's a good vlog. What's up, man? Where you been at, kid? Oh, well, you know how I'm bumming. I get one that has my name Let on me, the back. Let me put on a pinky ring one time. Let's read my jersey. Uh, for the payball thing? What's, 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 up? what's my jersey, man? Oh. Hey, happy new year there, happy big year. guy. What's yeah, up, you man? Jump in yeah. Just just one time. You like the just salt and pepper look? One time. Huh? The salt and pepper look? Yeah, I love the salt and there, pepper look. In there. Yo, really proud of you, man. You did fucking great at the tournament, appreciate man. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Fucking brought it. back Yo, status got, quo. We got invited to South by Southwest, which we all got to go to now. Oh, it's fucking. What's yeah, up? What you know about this? Huh? Where's Nick? Uh, not here. Old Davis. Might be coming. Man. Not in. He's so not in this it's one? It's you and Seth this week, right? Oh, just me and Seth. Let's go, man. Wait, are you still on the business call or are you not? Yo, oh, what are you wearing? That Bashers 10 pound plus certified double digit club. All right, so uh, we're, we're shooting. I'm not gonna show you what we're shooting, but we are shooting something super cool. The problem here, okay, the problem is that they gave me a jersey that not only is it too small for me to wear, but it literally stinks like sweat. Somebody wore this to shoot the paintball video that they shot. And I just don't like the, the working conditions. Smell this. Smelly dude, Wait, mine too. Right now. Yeah, but at least it's your sweat. Oh, you're smelling somebody. I'm who smelling. You? you got Billy? Oh, you don't even know who you're smelling. Right? Who? I don't know. Oh. Who, who no wore this? Uh, what? Had to be Billy, right? Right now. <coughs> <coughs> anyway, it's really, really bad. I don't mind. Okay, I don't mind. If it's my sweat, I'll wear it. I, I used to throw my, my gym clothes into the, into, the, into, the, into the locker with no problems. But this time around, it's somebody else's stanky ass sweat. This is our competition. See those little kids right there? Right there? They're going down. Holy shit, is that the American Ninja Warrior Nick Maniac Kirshner? Dude, I'm a big fan. What, was your name Nitro back in the day? Nitro? Yeah. No, it wasn't. Were you laser? No, it wasn't. Wait, were who those were some you? Some of your favorites? Yeah. Nitro and laser? Yeah. I was, uh, I got nothing. No? To be, I got you nothing. You couldn't make up, uh, I get it. Tor tornado, torpedo. T torpedo. That's, yeah. Torpedo's yeah, you word. got the, you, you, you're Mr. Torpedo? No, nah, they call me Mr. In and Out. Oh, 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 oh. I thought you were pointing at your, at your Johnson. My socks. Yo, uh, I like the haircut. You look like a, you wow, legit really? look like a, yeah, you look like Wait, a. Wait, have you not seen it yet? No, you look like a UFC fighter. Hey, thanks. It's kind of what I told myself. I was. Hopefully I trick people though. You're like, you're TJ, DJ Tillishaw, or well, TJ Dillashaw. Decided to show off <laughs> the robot a little himself. Bit late, a little bit late. Yo, uh, so you've been watching the CWL, the yeah. qualifiers? Yep. Who do you think is going to make it? Just give me the, 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 the top two that are going to make it. Top two? Yeah, give me two that are going to make it for sure, and two that are not going to make it for sure, if you want. I'm going to do, I'm going <coughs> to go further on your question. Of the borderline teams that are going to make it right now, um, to, like teams going in a bracket. Spacely's team, yes. Uh, who else? Who's who's on the Red Reserve will probably make it. Red Reserve will make it. What about Envy? What about Envy's already like guaranteed. Yeah, they already guaranteed. Not not guaranteed. Oh, because they went three and no. Yeah, they're two and zero or three and zero or something. Three and zero. So. What about Face? I'm mo I'm probably more worried about them than any other team. What about Hundred so. Thieves? More worried about Face. Yeah. Really? Yeah, because. They're doing that, like last night, they were like tweeting that they were doing roll swaps, so. Oh, shit. Yeah. Last minute, you can't that's, do that last minute. That's a yikes. That's a yikes, my it, you, you can swap specialists, but you can't really swap. Rolls? Rolls, guns, like. What is that? Dude, is that from the paintball? Nah, the mosquitoes. Texas, everything's bigger out here. Dude, look at the amount of hickeys that this dude got from his new piece. Damn. What sort of girl has a perfectly, perfectly circular mouth? <laughs> You, you wouldn't believe it. Like cup therapy thing? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I thought they were paintballs. You should try it though. You probably. I'm still like gonna. It. I'm still gonna say. Oh, look at the paintball shots. What's your What's your thing? Your what rotator cuff? Yeah. Do you probably Wait, like that? No, shot? it's it's a uh, it's a string. It's like, then you would like this. Where where they put it all over your upper it's back. Like After they release like, it, you just. It's something with your muscles. It's like. 
It sucks your toxins out. Don't feel like it. Time to go get some tacos, La Ventana. Seth, hey. how far are those tacos? Fire. Is Davis not coming with us, bro? He's with uh, Nick on the other car. Yo, how busy is this place? That's how good it is. I'm telling you right now, if these aren't the best tacos you've had here in Texas, I'm buying. Probably gonna go back to silver in like two weeks, but like get it professionally done. Are you what they call a silver daddy? Is that a thing? I don't know. It is. That's good too, is it? That's uh, rice water. It's milk rice water with cinnamon. Doesn't taste it. Do they? Add, they have to add sugar to it, right? Yeah, of course. Cinnamon and sugar. It's Mexican food, it's baby. Also. It's Mexican food, baby. I guess for the new year, I haven't really given you guys any new uh, taco spots. This restaurant that I'm in right now is called La Ventana, and I give this one a nine out of ten just on all levels. Everything about it is incredibly, incredibly good. It's probably my favorite taco spot in, in all of, uh, of, of Texas so far. I haven't tried certainly the, the super Mexican locations, but this one's close enough to where I feel like I'm back in Chicago and I'm having a really, really good taco. Here's other people's testimonies. So far, Hitch, how do you... How's that tongue? <laughs> How's the tongue? Dude. Yeah, you can see the little... You can literally see the tongue. Yeah. It's really good, right? Honestly, it doesn't have that much flavor. But you... Yeah. But you can see, like, the little membrane of, like, tongue. The taste buds. You can see the taste buds. It's kind of weird. Boss, you want some tongue? It's taste buds, it tastes really good. Come on. See, how's that tongue? Did you order tongue, Mike? Uh, I like the Huh? I like the brisket more. The brisket's incredible. What about you, Big Big T? Did you get some tongue? Or chicken. Chicken? I ordered steak. Ah, nice. All right, Ian, see you like next week sometime. <laughs> Mike, this is your first time here. How'd you feel? Let me bark. Good. Good. You, uh, I, I let everybody wear the, the this ring except for Halo players. Okay. But like he's not a Halo player, so he can wear it. You. I'm a retired Halo. Player. You're a retired Halo player. You, you you are a champion, so you, you just can't. So wait, was this one of the guys actually? Or no, this is the fifth game? one. Halo sent it to me. Oh, that is a, the Halo one. Yeah. Oh, this was like the Call of Duty one. No, no, no. I'm getting the Call of Duty. So, all right, Big T, you, you going home? Uh, I'm going home. Yeah. All right, see you tomorrow then. All right. Hundred percent. It was fire, right? Definitely like my favorite taco spot in all of Dallas so far. Maybe you give me chicken though. I feel like chicken's gotta be the most basic yeah. taco you get. I, 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 I've, I've never, I, listen, the, listen to these facts, okay? Asi listen, aside from Chipotle, I have never ever in my life, ever in my life, in any restaurant that serve, or any taco place, I've never ordered sh uh, shrimp or fish or chicken. Yeah, why would you? Nah, fish is worth it. Like, no. Shrimp, shrimp tacos are good. I like shrimp tacos. No, I pass on that. Heavy, heavy pass. Heavy pass. All right, there, bud. You come to the office? At the stew, uh, I think Seth's about to start streaming. Uh, the video that we shot today was was really really fun um, <clears throat> to do. It was uh, it made me reminisce a little bit about the good old you know twelve thirty five scuff house uh, days where I would single handedly put together an obstacle course and then I would work second camera for Hitch, a literal two man team that delivered one of the best goddamn series in esports history. Next to vision. Oh, such a good time. Anyway, I had, had a really good time. I am, I am, however, the most out of shape I've ever been. I did recover very quickly, though. I wasn't expecting to to bounce back as quickly as I did. All right, so 
Uh, as you guys know, last week I received a very, very cool art piece from a, from a graffiti artist named Guests. Um, and he, I commissioned him to write, to write, to, uh, to create another piece of art for me. This one's a lot bigger. Um, I don't know. Gotta make sure that I put that away so you guys don't see what you guys shouldn't. He did warn me, however, that he super taped it and added just way too much. So I'm gonna do my best to open this in speed, in fast speed motion. Um, and then we'll go from there. He did tell me that he was gonna super quadruple, triple box this so it, it's safe. And uh, he wasn't lying. He said he was gonna super tape it uh, to do it. The good thing about this this particular art piece is that it's it's on wood, um, so you know it'd be almost impossible to damage it. I'm not gonna try, but it would literally be almost impossible to damage it. He did he did warn me that he triple packed it. Rather be safe than sorry. His words exactly, and uh, and I appreciate it because. I got a good, I got a really, really good deal on this particular. Oh, oh, oh Matt, don't show it, don't show it yet, don't show it. Yet. And now that we've done that, here is the masterful piece by Gessler himself. Ooh. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Very happy with it. He showed me pictures already, but to see it in person, it's amazing. So it's a good, you know, I, I, I've collected graffiti pieces for the for, for the entirety of my life. I have a dime piece, uh, one of the most famous graffiti writers that have uh, ever, ever lived. He transcended, he revolutionized graffiti because he started doing 3D the way that nobody else had been doing 3D up until that. I have canvases by Totem, canvases by Cope, canvases by, I just have a lot, uh, a big collection. I'm finally happy to have you know, this specific one because I have been a very, very big admirer of uh, of his work, so. Super, super hype about it. I wonder how he did it. I always wonder that. I'm like, how did they do it? So I, I'm gonna sit here and study it for a little bit just so I can try to figure it out. It's so insane how good this guy is. I forgot to end the vlog uh, and I'm already home, so. I apologize for that. Anyway, thank you for tuning in. If you guys enjoyed the video, please do not leave without even like having said that boys and girls and with that said, I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow, hopefully as usual. And as per usual, the same. Damn.